Hello Federation Superstars, welcome on board Galactic Federation Druid Ship Earth One. This is Project Blue Star 2000 to 2012. Uh, this is a communications group, Galactic Federation, and we'll be counting down the days to 2012, looking into uh, metaphysical aspects of this amazing transition that's taking place in and around the planet Earth. Uh, pertaining to the photon belt and also the dimensional activity which is occurring in and without every single living entity around the planet and within this universe and solar system. Magnificent stuff. Uh, we're going to cut down to, um, to the planet Earth and look at some climate change news where um, the United Kingdom are bracing themselves for some very severe weather, including um, some very large um, uh, sea wave activity and, uh, and some atmospheric disturbance. So uh, without further ado, let's have a, a quick squeeze of climate change news for December the 2nd. Britain will be hammered by hurricane force storm winds this weekend. Experts predict winds of 70 to 80 miles per hour are hitting their way. Bringing the threat of widespread damage and heavy downpours will add to the nation's misery. On top of the hurricane wind storm alert, a massive Atlantic water surge coming down from Iceland was expected to hit the west off coast of Ireland over the next 48 hours. Authorities are warning shipping and people living along the Atlantic coast to be on their guard for record sea swells more than 14 metres high. 14 metres high. The high seas alert comes just weeks after the east coast of England braced itself for tidal surges, sparking flood fears and evacuations. The continually bleak outlook has sparked growing concerns that global warming is taking its toll and blurring Britain's seasons. The latest weather warnings follow a year in which the UK has witnessed freak flash flooding, tornadoes, blizzards and gale force winds. In Mexico, the proper Kiata Pital volcano spewed ash and steam on Saturday in a giant plume stretching some 3,000 metres over 2,000, uh, sorry, two miles high. The eruption southeast of Mexico City was a major explosive event, totally different to those since the year 2000, and related to a rupture of lava inside the volcano's crater. The volcanic activity started at 6.20 a.m and officials issued a yellow alert signalling no immediate risk to the local population. Ash began falling uh, on Puebla, the closest city of the volcano, a couple of hours after the eruption. So some volcanic activity and uh, obviously some atmospheric activity affecting the United Kingdom as we speak. This is a Federation transmission and uh, let's cut to some mass and Federation archives. We hope this day finds you well and uh, your preparation for climate change is uh, also finding you well. Get going superstars, it's all SFYC, get yourself sorted out, make sure that you're going to be the one that's going to get through this climate change. Do not wait for others to get involved, do it yourself. This is a Fed transmission, we'll speak to you soon. Bulls running beautifully, and so are the champions who are down in the fish pond, the sharks, the whales, the beautiful little fishies. How you going superstars? Oh, did they come? Look, they're going to think they're going to get fed, so they'll come and say good day. Yeah, look at that. beautiful little yellows. Hey girls. Yeah, how you doing? It's the uh, 2nd of December, 2007. And uh, the boys have made it successfully down to Mount Martha, looking at that big, beautiful ocean, feeling the wonderful energies of the Shambhala gum tree next door, and just sleeping in slumber and dreaming, dreaming and dreaming. And that is the future of tomorrow, is just dreaming, dreaming, dreaming. Allow it to dream and become. That's the time that we're living in. The fifth dimension is merging with the third so look out, boys and girls, we're in for a beautiful experience. The clouds have come in here in Central Australia and it's just lovely. Yesterday was a uh, just a warm 46 degrees out here in the desert. 46, it's not too bad. I was going to put a beanie on, I was going to throw a jumper on just to see if I could handle it. But uh, 46 degrees Fahrenheit, so you get to double that. It's 80 uh, 94 plus 30 is 124 Fahrenheit. So uh, whatever measurement you have 
wherever you may be in this beautiful planet, uh, it was uh, it was fairly hot, but withstandable. And that's what the uh, the Federation village and the uh, the dome infrastructure that we're building is all about. Let's stick it into all kinds of environments, all kinds of variabilities, and see what what may happen in the future. It's coming along just beautifully. There is uh, lots in the sky. There may be Syrians, there may be Pleiadians, there may be Arcturians, there may be reptilians or dinoids or insectoids. There's a few of them out there. But uh, whoever those lights may be, they're sending you beautiful vibrations from above so you can meet that beautiful date we have, 2012. This is Fed TV. It's the second day of December. The boys are having a wonderful time in Mount Martha, Victoria. And Benny's up north, 1,600 kilometres up north, 3,500 kilometres away from Tommy and Joey up there in Darwin, finishing his intensive care paramedic study. And Mum's back down there in Melbourne. And uh, you guys, the legends of Fed TV, out there in video world, superstars, legends, magnificent entities of the third dimension, we hope you're doing well. This is Fed TV. I hope you enjoy this transmission. Au revoir. It's the second of December, it's the festive season, and I'm in a sanctuary world nature centre. Hello to Tommy and Joey down there in Melbourne. Oh, I bet it is just looking stunning. We'll be there in six days' time. Magnificent. I've just been playing around with our mates, the planets. I'll give you a bit of a squeeze. There's Saturn, the beautiful little Earth, Mars, the big sun. Ah, oh, and there's Jupiter swinging round. She looks pretty good. The planets are the keys. They're the energy forces that make us who we are. And uh, the Federation's going to get stuck into the planet shortly. Who are we? Where are we? This is Federation TV. Countdown to 2012. Yeah. And welcome back on board Galactic Federation Druid Ship Earth One. Uh, tomorrow's transmission will head down to the Earth Sanctuary Kitchen and uh, we'll get a vegetarian surprise from uh, that beautiful little chicken, Lillian. Have fun. See you tomorrow. Hide coming from the inside. You're gonna hide cause you sit right beside me, my son.